my, I looked at my phone and it changed the time and I went, oh, I got a little bit. Now I thought, when's it going to go off? I look. <laughs> Your bike oh. looks so much like my father-in-law's strike way, colored and everything. Oh, this one? Yeah. Actually, the alarm don't go off. Yeah, it did. It went off this way. Yeah. Of course, that thing yeah. don't, don't, don't even have 400 miles on it and it's three years old. You know, I never have mine on the odometer. I've got it on the trip meter all the time. I turned on the other day, it's got 27,000 on it. <laughs> well, hell, the trip we made down and saw Dave, you said that was the first time the bike had been out of the state. Yeah. Just back and forth to work, back and forth to work. You've been making a lot of runs to the Chinese food uh, place. Back and forth to work, back and forth to work. Bitch behind Keith. You don't really. <laughs> I'm the rebel? Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> right around the block here, let him film that, Keith. <laughs> film at 11. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. He's the judge for the next one, baby. No. 54 Shadow. 54 Shadow is, and he's going to help him. Uncle Todd had, uh, jumped up and was going to be the next uh, He would volunteered, but you know what? We need him for statistics real bad because EDR wanted to take a break. And I was horrible at statistics. I already made so many mistakes the first week into it, he had to correct my mistakes. I mean, I'll do it if nobody else will do it, but it'll be a shambles trying to get me to do it. If somebody else would retire. Yeah. Instead of in search of the grand 100 points. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know nothing about them computers. <laughs> well, you're a chemist. Yeah, which is it? I can't get my lips closed. Uh, I don't know nothing about them computers. I'm going to run back to your place for a little bit. Oh, that sounds good. Bullshit. Then I'll hit the road. Um, so then Aaron's going to be breaking off probably and hitting the tollway, right? He's heading north there. And then, uh, yeah. Nice meeting you, nice well, meeting you too. Yeah. Hey, we should come back to the house, but I can understand then. Catch you later. All right, see ya. Well, ugly. Well, pop up there one day, nice but I ain't going to you <laughs> Otherwise, every goddamn federale between her and yeah. Chicago will be laying in wait for me. Better not let me know when you're flying. We had a really great meetup. I got to meet GL Boca for the first time and Gentleman's Nine for the first time. So it ended up being pretty good. Beautiful weather, actually slightly cool if anything, but very nice. Nothing but a few sprinkles of rain that it rained on. And there ended up being nine of us total. I figured somewhere between eight and twelve, nine, that's a pretty good number. I call it a very good success. Nobody went away hungry.
when they did the Navy Thomas interview. So anybody that submitted questions, uh, I don't know if it's just going to be posted on GL Boca's channel or GL Boca and Navy Thomas' channel, but if you're interested in that, watch for it. Now a bunch of us are going back to my place to relax and uh, for those that want, maybe have a little bit of dessert. I think there's still some leftover homemade pumpkin pie for those that want some pumpkin pie. Yeah, I heard that. I think he was born hungry.